Are you looking to captivate your audience and enhance the visual appeal of your website? With the advanced slideshow widget, you can showcase stunning visuals and key messages for a dynamic user experience. Create engaging slideshows with full-width images and video panels. To feature your app. Feature a future or current sale. Grow your social audience and more. Adding an advanced slideshow widget to your website page involves three steps. First, you'll add an advanced slideshow widget to a page. Second, you'll customize the widget. And last, you'll publish the widget to your website and mobile app. Let's get started. Hover over the side menu in your comments old dashboard and select Site Creator. At the top of the page, select Pages. Find the desired page and select the three icon on the far right. Select Edit from the options listed. Select Plus Add section at the top of the list. Select the Advanced Slideshow widget. Now that you have added an Advanced Slideshow widget to a page, let's start customizing the widget. Locate the Advanced Slideshow widget and click the pencil icon on the right side of the widget row. Here, you can customize the widget slides, settings, and navigation. Let's begin by adding slides to your Advanced Slideshow. Select Add Slides. Select Upload to launch your media gallery. Here, you can upload images or slides for the widget. Now customize the components of the slide. Enter a headline. This is a short, attention-grabbing title that highlights the main message or feature of the slide. Enter a subheadline. This is a brief, supportive line that provides additional context or detail to the headline. Enter the button text. This button, when selected will redirect the shopper to your desired page or product collection. Choose your click-through option. Select the option page from the drop-down to select an existing page or collection, or create a new collection by selecting plus create new collection. Select the option external link to enter the URL for the external link. Enter a hex code for the text color on the slide. Select your desired text alignment on the slide. In the Show section on section, choose where you wish to publish this section. All, web, or app. App. You can repeat these steps and add multiple slides to your advanced slideshow widget. Now that you have added slides to your advanced slideshow, let's configure the slide settings, such as transition and navigation. First, let's customize the transition for the widget. Select the Transition Style drop-down and select your desired transition. Scroll the Transition Duration slider to customize the duration of the transition. Scroll the Slide Delay slider to set a delay to the transition. Next, let's customize the navigation for the widget. Enable the Show Arrows toggle to display arrows to navigate to the next or previous slide. Enable the Show Dot Indicators toggle to display navigational dots on the slideshow. Enable the Autoplay Slides toggle to Autoplay Slideshow. Enable the Loop Slides toggle to play the slideshow in a loop. Enable the Pause on Hover toggle to pause the slideshow when hovering. Enable the Allow Swiping toggle for touch or mouse navigation. Lastly, customize the anchor tag name to create a unique URL for the widget. This tag can be used to link or redirect the shopper to this widget. We are almost there. Now that you have added the slides and customized them, your last and final step is to publish the widget to your website and mobile app. Scroll down to show section on and choose where you wish to publish this section. To all, web, or app. Your site preview will update to reflect the changes. When you are satisfied, select Publish in the top right corner of the site creator to save the widget. And that's it. You've successfully added an advanced slideshow widget to your website page. If you have any questions, reach out to our support team by selecting the support icon in the bottom right corner of your comments old dashboard. Or visit our help center to learn more about the site creator widgets. Happy creating!